Farm Guy here with an update to the fruit greenhouse by the MTL modding team. This is for all platforms, PC, Mac, and console. I'm on PS5 on Rock Crawl with this update video, and it's 20.89 megabytes to download. Oh, uh, the slot counts, I forgot to write that down. Um, this is just concerning the update change log 1.3.00. And I will read it uh, as follows. Added uh, tomatoes, lettuce, and strawberries in the bulk by com uh, community request. So they are listening to you, the players and the viewers. Uh, also, something quite significant and not to be overlooked. Added tomatoes, lettuce, and strawberries to all trailers, wagons, shovels, and the farm silo for better transport and storage. Um, we'll have to check that out too. Cycles per hour increased from 10 to 15 and increased the pipe unloading speed from 650 to 750. Uh, adapted to current patch and description adapted to the current update. Right. <clears throat> so uh, let's look at the greenhouse first. And that's still where you're going to find it under production and greenhouses. And there it is. $12,500. Um, takes herbicide, seeds, dry fertilizer, and water, and it now produces tomatoes, lettuce, uh, grapes, strawberries, and olives in bulk, not in pallets. So pallets will not spawn. This is the input area for the products, dry goods, and the liquid goods go in here. Um, as you can, may or may not see, I have them all turned on. And as we can see, they are chugging away like crazy. And I just literally just turned it on. <clears throat> so let's have a look at it, at our production chain here. And as you can see, I've turned them all on because usually I just do them one at a time to see what we get because pallets stack up and but this one they're all going to appear here they're all going to be in storage and all the recipes are actually the same uh, so 360 cycles per month um, and the recipe is all exactly they're all exactly the same 200 water 100 seeds 50 fertilizer and 50 herbicide and 500 liters per cycle is produced Right, so let's look at the trailers. And if you notice, uh, grapes and olives are there, yes. And as we scroll back down to the end, lettuce, tomatoes, and strawberries are in every single trailer. Every single trailer, yes. Uh, even, oh, not the, not the silage trailers. <clears throat> bulk trailers all the bulk trailers i do believe the silage yeah the silage trailers new how about auger wagons yes indeed auger wagons grapes olives uh strawberries tomatoes and lettuce in all the auger wagons uh aside from the silage and or beet root crop only now if we look at the uh, front loader tools um that also yes so all buckets uh let's take a look at uh wheel wheel loaders bucket yes there we go right so it said farm silos let's go to silos and let's just put up just the smallest standard silo here and um we have the uh, Silo King here, ready to go. And if we go under this silo, we should be able to see what we can. Let's turn our help windows on here. There we go. <clears throat> and uh, we should see what we can fill. Wheat, barley, oats, canola. Okay. There's grapes. Yes, grapes, olives. And tomatoes, strawberries, and lettuce. There you have it. So, um, this is quite the th this is quite the deal, really. Um, 
I don't know how they they keep every time they just keep making these things better and better. So what we're going to do, of course, is we're going to run it. There they all are. There's the uh, strawberries and lettuce and um, tomatoes and olives and grapes. They're all in there growing away. And we're going to go ahead a month, see what how, how long all this stuff lasts. And then we're going to we're going to fill up. Um, we're going to unload, see how fast it unloads, because they said they sped up the unload as well, speed. And then we're going to uh, dump it in a silo, right? So we're going to try all the new things right on. Okay, we'll be back in a second. All right, so we are back. And uh, let us take a look at what we got here. Oh, we have run out of water and seeds. It is just too fast wow it has sucked that all up so if you got them all turned on uh it is it is gonna it is gonna bleed the water and seeds dry which is not a surprise like f three four five items going all gung-ho uh look at that we we managed to get a hundred thousand of each product and still some fertilizer and herbicide of course those are lesser used on the recipe right okay so just so you know, you probably would have ended up with um, a way more of a single product if I would have done it all by its lonesome and not have them all turned on. Right, so let's check out the unload speed here and then I'll just show you uh, where where it all, the, the items that go in. But I really want to see, I want to see what lettuce looks like in a trailer. Oh my goodness, it's green. <laughs> And uh, the, f the fill speed is, yeah, it's going to take a little while to uh, fill up 100,000 liters. But, <laughs> bravo, gentlemen, bravo. The green, that did, they're dumping lettuce into the, <laughs> into there. So let's go put this away. So, um, yeah, probably could definitely speed up that unload speed a little bit more especially if you're producing that many uh, that much product but I understand not wanting to go totally overboard so um, okay what's next let's see what's uh, okay we know what olives and grapes grapes and olives are always uh, tomatoes okay let's see what's to oh dear look at that nice I don't think you, I mean, <laughs> that's that's pretty good, um, must admit. I mean, wow, okay. Look at that, tomatoes. Well, um, so let's, let's see if we can sell them at a sell anything point. Will it, will it accept tomatoes? Oh yes, look at that. Out it goes. And in the money goes. $29,000 worth of tomatoes. All right, uh, then the last one is strawberries. I wanna see what, I just, uh, straw, what, what, what does strawberries look like in bulk being poured into a trailer? That I need to know. <clears throat> and there we go. Look at them there, strawberries. Nice. Right. Um, very nice. Uh, of course, um, as, a, as being a factory, you can also set them to selling or distributing if you have somewhere that, um, like a factory that takes these products and Believe me, this these uh, this greenhouse will keep any factory supplied with plenty of product. Um, let's just see what the grapes. I'm pretty sure the grapes should be this because grapes are a bulk item, and um, all those grapes. Yeah, so that's that's not uh, that's 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 standard. Very good. Right. Okay. Wow, that's fantastic. Okay. Oh, I'm sorry. So sorry. Excuse me. Uh, whoop. 
Um, so this is solid fertilizer. I have it in uh, in these, but it's it very readily goes in here. No problems there. Uh, seeds is the same thing. I have seeds in here. A very nice, giant, wide input area. Very nice. As for uh, the water and herbicide, uh, I think I do. I have any herbicide left? Uh, well, I got water left. I'll just show you where that goes in. I didn't. Ha I don't have any herbicide in a tank, but it goes in the same place right here. Right here by this blue tank with the drop on it herbicide and water going in there and there we go herbicide and water going in just like so and yeah there you have it another fantastic update to an already fantastic mod greenhouse fruit greenhouse by the mtl modding team 20.89 megabytes to download uh, let's just uh, give you one last tidbit of information here and we'll tell you the slot counts uh, greenhouses there it is uh, 10 slots on console there we go thank you all for watching I'm Looney Farm Guy and remember it's only a game so till next time bye for now